Hi guys, it's Mooney with Mooney Reads and I'm back with another tag. I saw this tag a while ago at the Book of Bulls and I'll link her video down below. It's a really cute video and I said I was going to do it but then I got really sick and I'm actually doing a lot better today which is really good but I've just, I've been dying the past, I don't know, week or so. That's why I haven't uploaded anything but I wanted to do this Christmas tag today because it's Christmas Eve and you know what? Thought it'd be fun to do. I'm gonna go right ahead to the questions. Question number one What's your favorite Christmas movie? My all time favorite Christmas movie is Nightmare Before Christmas. Now, I'm not sure if that's a Halloween movie or a Christmas movie, but I'm gonna pretend it's a Christmas movie for the sake of this video. Another movie I really, really like is The Family Stone, and it's not really. A Christmas movie but I mean it's based on Christmas and getting together for Christmas and stuff like that so I guess it counts and finally love actually which is weird because I know that I stated that I don't like romantic comedies but I just I love that movie number two are you on the naughty or on the nice list I am definitely on the nice list I mean really number three show us an embarrassing Christmas card photo I don't have Christmas card photos. We don't do Christmas cards in Venezuela, so that's there's none of that. I got nothing to show you. Have you ever had a white Christmas? This might come as a surprise to many of you, but I've never seen snow. I mean, I've seen it on television and stuff, but I've never like physically been able to like touch snow and stuff. No, no white Christmas is for me. <laughs> Where do you usually spend the holidays? I spend it usually at my parents' house. And that's pretty much it. Sometimes we'll spend it with his parents. It all just depends on the year and what we're doing. Play or sing your favorite Christmas song. That is not happening now. Do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? We open all our presents on Christmas Eve. It's a Venezuelan tradition. In fact, um, it came to a surprise to me that people open presents the next day because to us, the 25th of December, is usually or getting over the hangover from the day before day. Can you name all of Santa's reindeer? No. I cannot name. I can name Rudolph and Prancer and Dancer. That's about it. Blitzen! Okay, I can name a few. But no, I can't name them all. Not even a little bit. In Venezuela, Santa Claus isn't who brings you presents. It's um, little baby Jesus. Like, we have Niño Jesus. And that's who brings you the presents and not Santa. What holiday tradition are you looking forward to the most this year? To be honest, this year has kind of been a very non-Christmassy year for me because I've had a full-time job, which is 10 to 6, and I've also had school, and it's my last year of my MA degree, so I've been so full, and I've just, I, mostly I've wanted to sleep. I haven't really been looking forward to many traditions. I guess gift giving because I love giving gifts. Is your Christmas tree real fake? My mom insisted on real Christmas trees. And have you any idea how long it takes to ship a Christmas tree from wherever they ship them from to Venezuela? Those things were expensive and I thought it was just such a waste of money and natural and, and resources. So we finally convinced her to get a fake one. And me and my sister and my brother, we all have fake Christmas trees. and. They're the bomb. What's your all-time holiday food and holiday sweet treat? This is also interesting because I will probably name something you all haven't eaten. My favorite holiday food is definitely ajacas, and I will put a link down below to what ajacas are because explaining it should probably be a video on its own. But they're amazing, and everyone has them here, and it's funny because we'll have them like from November or December-ish all the way to like, I don't know, March, because most families make hundreds of them. Yup, I love ajakas. And my favorite holiday treat, I'm not really a sugar loving person. I, I m much rather eat salty things, anything with chocolate in it, I guess, but there's nothing in particular that I'm like, yay, holidays, you know? No, I mostly like savory, salty food. Be honest, do you like receiving or giving presents? I love giving. I love, love, love giving. In fact, I'm kind of uncomfortable with receiving, but I love giving. Okay, sorry about that. I had to call and I had to take it. So that's your tackiest Christmas attire. Um, Venezuelans, uh, it, it says like ugly sweater and stuff, and let's face it, I could go to the beach right now if I wanted to. 
I don't really have anything like that. I mean, I'm, I've worn ugly things for Christmas, but like it, the year 2000, I think my lips were silver or something like that. But I don't have those pictures. Like I've never worn a snowman suit or anything like that. So we just mostly wear like cocktail dresses and stuff for Christmas. What would be your dream place to visit for Christmas? That's hard. I think it'd be something like London or Canada just because I've always wanted to see snow. I really want to see snow at least once in my life. I think Canada has, lo has plenty of snow to share with the world. Does your family have a special holiday recipe that you would like to share? Yes, we do. Every Venezuelan family makes ajacas differently and my family makes them differently because everyone does. I could give you the recipe <laughs> if you really wanted it, but be warned, this is over a day's work to make ajacas. Are you a pro prison rapper or do you fail miserably? I think I'm alright. I mean, I'm not a pro, but I'm definitely not, I'm not gonna fail miserably at it. This year I didn't do so well, but that's because I was rapping with a fever. What made you realize the truth about Santa? I was really old when I realized the truth about Santa, but it was because my Christmas list had a very specific item in it, and then I saw my parents buying it and hiding it in the car, and I think they just gave up that year. You know, they were just like, let the girls see it. Do you make New Year's resolutions and do you stick to them? Yes, I do. And yes, I do stick to them for the most part. I mean, I make realistic resolutions. Like, what makes the holiday special for you? I think what makes holidays special for me is the fact no matter where you are in the world, it seems like everyone is celebrating Christmas or, you know, the holidays. And it's, it's a really special thing because sometimes I feel so separated from the world because I live in Venezuela and I feel like all my friends and stuff are back in the U.S or a lot of my friends are anyway. And the booktube community is mostly Canada and the US or maybe, you know, other English speaking countries and I feel so left out, I guess. And I like the holidays because it reminds me that no matter where you are, it's just there's something that brings you all together. And that's a really nice feeling not to feel so separated from the world. So this has been the Christmas tag and I'm gonna go get some cookies out of the oven because I was making some cookies. Happy holidays no matter where you are and what you celebrate and have a productive and amazing new year. Hopefully I will see you guys soon. Hopefully this cold will not keep me from making any more videos and let's hope 2013 brings amazing things to us, our loved ones, and the rest of the world. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, you know. What holiday tradition are you looking? Uh, what holiday tradition are you looking? Why can't I say that? <laughs>